Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial. My name is Michael Novello and this is a multi-part tutorial about a uh, French coffee maker. We make that this thing uh, where you put the coffee in there and then you press um, down and it makes a wonderful fresh coffee. And because this is a multi-part tutorial I Splitted it up and we begin with the setup and the glass. Okay, at first let's add a plane. Scale this up by 20. <coughs> Doesn't matter how big it is, it should be bigger than your camera view. Then we delete the default lamp and we add two planes. The first plane put here and we rotate it in the y-axis by 45 degrees and let's add now a quick material we should change here to cycle render for sure and we use notes and we do a mission material let's rename this at light so <coughs> uh, light yellow and give it a slightly yellow tone and let's use uh, let's try 10 then duplicate this put it here rotate it in the y-axis by 90 degrees and press here to get a single material and rename this to light blue then choose a slightly blue color and this is our light setup. Let's reset our 3D cursor and put the camera in your view. Um, start the screen cast keys so you can see what I'm doing. With Control Alt and Zero you can put the camera into your actual view. Now let's let's add a simple cylinder to this and move it to layer two. So go to the layer layer two and in the front view let's scale this guy here a little bit down in with the other set axis. Yes, and then in the edit mode go up like this then you have your origin and bottom that's uh, yeah that's how I work uh, if I have something on the bottom um, and I want to rotate it maybe uh, around here sometimes it's better you have the, the origin point here at the bottom. So now um, back to edit mode we add one loop cut here and another loop cut here. Then we close this here on the bottom um, let's get it inwards a little bit up extrude it, scale it bring it down and extrude it another time scale it inwards and bring it down to zero of the set axis here on this red line then extrude another time and we merge them in the center so and on the top top view yeah click the this one here and we bring it out and down a little bit and then we select these two guys here and bring them 
out as well and a little bit more down, maybe just two here. Okay. Then the with uh, control A, apply the scale and the rotation, set it smooth, and press control and three to add a modifier here, subdivision surface modifier by three, set the render view, uh, render subdivision to three as well. And let's go on time in here and pull it a little bit more out and a little more down and this should work. Okay. Now um, we need some thickness on the glass. Um, this is really easy. We add a solidify modifier and voila, we have our glass. So that's it for this part. In the next part we are adding some other stuff, we adding the metal stand. Metal stand goes here and we add another metal around here because we have to go, we have to have something on that because we put um, the handle goes here and we need something where we could put it on we can put the handle directly on the glass and then in the third tutorial we add this handle and in a few other tutorials we add the mechanic here and so on so this was part one and see you in the next tutorial thank you bye